Hey, what do you hear? What do you say? My Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Google Plus, your sister's ass, the Pony Express, a very, very ticked off Vic here. You know what ticks me off now? New Year's Eve. I'll explain. Just, just follow me. In general, I guess I like New Year's Eve, and I kind of get why it's a big deal. I mean, technically, it's the last night of the old year, and the next day is a brand new year. Oh, boy. Yay. So it is meaningful because of that. Don't, don't get me wrong. So it's the eve of the new year. But that's kind of arbitrary, no? I mean, why not have a new month's eve? I mean, we get a new month every month. Or New Week's Eve. Why not make it really special and have a new Decades Eve every 10 years? Okay, so it's it's every year. I get it. Every year we need to have an excuse to get totally gooned and shit-faced and be hung over the next day. That's what New Year's Day really is. It's just recover from a hangover day. We should have a New Year's Eve and then a shit-faced hungover day. Well, I, I can't stay up until midnight anymore anyway. I mean, the last time I stayed up until midnight was 1983. If I don't have a show that night, I'm in bed right after Jeopardy. Stay up until midnight? Hey, fucking mine. I, I have a cat whose ass is in my face at 5 a.m. every morning. And my body is going to take a shit at 6 a.m. whether I'm awake or not. My cat and my ass and Jimmy Crack Corn don't care what time I went to sleep. Stay up until midnight and get wasted and risk shitting in my bed? Fuck that. And another thing. It's a fucking pain in the ass because of the date change thing. This fucking thing happens every fucking year. So you finally get used to writing 2019 on everything. Uh, documents, checks, anything you need to fill out that requires the date. And then, boom! Once again, you have to reprogram your brain for a new year and you keep putting down 2019 and then you spend five minutes trying to turn the one into a two and the nine into a zero and and your checks look like you're a fucking serial killer or you're trying to figure out the goddamn Da Vinci code. And everything else you need to fill out looks like an angry child's coloring book. Oh yeah, and this goes on till April. All because we have a new year. And another thing, I'm not going to Times Square. Fuck that. I have never been there, and I have no intentions of even going there. I have no desire to stand like a fucking penguin huddled up against a bunch of other smelly penguins just to keep warm from the body heat. I'd rather stay home and watch my own balls drop. How about New Year's resolution? There's another one. Oh, I'm going to start a diet. Oh, I'm going to start to work out and lose weight. Oh, I'm not going to drink starting January 1st. Oh, I'm going to try to be patient and nice with everyone in the new year. You couldn't be nice last year, you fucking miserable bastard. You have to pick a day to start being nice, you fucking animal. And you're all full of shit. You all fall down by January 3rd anyway, and then you do it all again next year. I set New Year's resolution that I, I know I can accomplish. I will not go to the moon in 2020. How about that? I refuse to go. I will not bang an alligator in the ass in the new year. On January 1st, I will not eat dog shit or run off a cliff. How about those New Year's resolutions? I guarantee you, I'll keep all of mine. And what the fuck is up with the song, Old Lang Syne? Sounds like an, an aging German guy. Hey, remember that fucking guy who lived in the old neighborhood down the block? Who? Old Lang Syne? Yeah, the Syne family. Lang was a nice guy, and it's not even spelled old, O-L-D. It's spelled old, A-U-L-D, old. What the hell does that even mean? What's an old? What's a Lang? And what the fuck is a Zine? This is the song we should sing. Should old acquaintance be forgot? Yeah, fuck them. Look, I wish each of you a happy new year. I hope you drive carefully because that's another thing about New Year's Eve. 300 million people driving half in a bag with a fucking gazoo in their mouth. Everyone, please just be safe and enjoy your evening wherever you're going and whatever you're doing. Let's, let's try to make 
next year better than the last year. How, how about that for a New Year's resolution? That's something to shoot for, no? New Year's Eve, that's what ticks me off.